so for this video i'm going to be showing you guys the trash man vest component for gta so you can put the trash man vest on any um outfit that you want i guess so you are going to be using all your outfits except for the one you have on before doing the glitch and you also make want to make sure that you purchase either a rebreather or um, an air piece from ammunition so just go to ammunition excuse me ammunition or um you just go to ammunition and purchase either a rebreather or an earpiece so you're going to be using all your outfits except for the one you have on before you um, do the glitch so when you're ready to do the glitch you just want to go ahead and hit your pause button and go into swap character and you also want to make sure that you deleted your second character before um doing the glitch or you can delete her um before you start the glitch like i'm going to show you right here because i've got to delete my second character so i'm going to delete her right now for um the people that haven't already deleted her So when your two characters load in right here, you just want to go ahead and go over to the second character. And if you don't see um, the edit button for that character, like right, you don't see no edit, go ahead and press um, whatever button. I think it's square on PS4 to delete her, but on Xbox it's going to be X. So go ahead and delete the second character, and then um, it's going to ask you to confirm it and all that. But yeah, if you don't see um, um, the button to delete it, it's going to probably have a button that says edit. And then you just want to go ahead and press um, A, or I think that's x on ps4 to edit the character so i'm going to show you guys right here so if you hadn't already deleted your second character that's what you should have done so right here now you said now it says press um a to edit her or him i don't know what it's going to be for you guys we just want to go ahead and press whatever button it says to edit him and you're going to get this alert right here you just want to go ahead and accept it and if your, if your second character turned out to be a male when you um edit it just change it into a female when you um come in here and then you just want to go ahead and um Press save and continue. You want to take, I mean, make a random name for it. it doesn't matter. And then go ahead and take the picture, and it's gonna um, load you inside into your new session after the casino DLC trailer. So after you load inside your new session, you just want to go ahead and open your map. And if you don't see any clothing stores on your map, like me, go ahead and go um, switch sessions or um, find a new session, and then the clothing store should appear. But if you do see the clothing stores on your map, you just want to go ahead and make your way over to the, um, the nearest clothing store. So I just loaded inside of my new session and now as you can see we can, f we can see the clothing stores on the map. So now we're just going to go ahead and make our way over to um, the clothing store. So when you get to the clothing store you just want to go ahead and purchase what I'm what I'm going to be buying. So you want to come to the top section, go to denim jackets and buy the distressed denim jacket. So go to the top section, go to denim jackets and buy the distressed denim jacket. It feels like After this you buy that, is never going you want to go to the tucked t-shirts. And then you want to go ahead and purchase the black classic so go to the tuck t-shirts which is going to be in the top section and you want to buy the black classic the sizes run after small that if you, want to you just want to make your way depressed. over to the pants section go to sport pants and buy the spotted muscle pants so go to the, um, pan, um, the pants section go to sport Enjoy. pants and buy the spotted muscle pants after that just go to the shoe section go to the boots and this is going to be for the um the yellow tron shoes so you just want to go to the, um, the boot section and you want to go ahead and purchase the um, black slack boots. So go to the boot section and go ahead and buy the black slack boots, which should be like number 33. But then when you purchase them, it's going to make it number 35. But just go ahead and buy the black slack boots. So after you buy the black slack boots, go to the accessories. You want to go to, um, when you come to accessories, you want to go to your earrings. And if your character has any earrings on, go ahead and just take them off. Like mine had earrings on, so I'm just going to go and take them off. So after you take off the earrings, you want to go to the gloves section and you want to purchase the light wool and tactical. After you purchase that, just go ahead and come save the outfit. And now when you save the outfit, um, you want to save in the slot that your main character has the outfit that you don't want to lose in. So if your main character has the outfit that you don't want to lose in, in slot 20, don't save this in slot 20, save this in a different slot. So just go ahead and save in the slot that your main character has the outfit on that you don't want to lose in. So after you saved it, go ahead and um, purchase the Chica outfit. Is going to be under Rather standard outfits and then after that you just want to hit your pause button and then you just want to go into creator so 
so after you load into creator you just want to go ahead and go to um create or create a race and you just want to go to land race and then go ahead and fill out all these um options with the right triangles on them it doesn't have to be anything specific just put random stuff in there then you want to put the um, maximum players on two and put the root type on point to point and then open your map and you want to go ahead and warp over to the airport so after you warp over to the airport just go ahead and hit b and go to the placement go ahead and place the triggers after you place your trigger just back out go to the um, lobby camera take it and then back out and then go to the checkpoint now when you make the race it has to be only um more than 0.62 miles so just make it like 0.63 or 0.64 miles but anyway when you're done making the race go ahead and um hit b twice and then you want to go ahead and test the race when you're done making it so remember it has to be only more than 0.62 miles so either point either 0.63 or 0.64 miles is going to be good enough So when you finish the race, you're gonna get that alert. You wanna go ahead and accept it, and then after that, it's gonna load you in right here. You just want your pause button, go to online, and go into choose character. So after your characters um load in, you just want to go ahead and go over to your second character that had a cheek outfit on, and then you want to hit um delete on her. So make sure you're on your second character that has a cheek outfit on, and then you want to go ahead and hit delete on her, and then it's gonna load in two new characters, and from here you just want to hit B, so it backs you out into single player or um story mode. So when you load into story mode, just hit your pause button, go to online, go to play GT online, and just go into invite only session. So when you load in, first thing you want to do is, if you care about the outfit that you don't want to lose, go ahead and um, go save it. And I recommend saving it towards the bottom slot because we're going to be merging um, some other outfits. So just go ahead and save this towards the bottom slot if you care about the outfit that you didn't want to lose because it's not going to be saved when you um, come online. So once you save the outfit, now um, I don't have any outfits I really want to put the um, trash man vest on. But go ahead and make the outfit you want to put the trash man vest on. So I'm just going to put it. Um, I'm just gonna get my um, top back so it doesn't give me the invisible torso So just in case you guys don't have that so I'm just gonna put on the um, if you want black joggers Just go ahead and put on the um, black utility high pants. I'm gonna show you guys and then that should give you the um, Black joggers with the um, Tron shoes, but yeah, just go ahead and put on any out make any outfit you want that you want to put the um, The um, trash man vest on there you go. So right now I'm just Thank gonna you. put the um, trash man vest on the black joggers with um, with the black joggers and the um, Tron shoes. So after you've got your outfit ready with no accessories on, go ahead and go to um, hit your pause button, go to online, go to jobs, play jobs, rockstar, rockstar created, go to versus, and go start up a job called Crook Cops. And when you start up the job, you want to put the clothing on player owned or the glitch isn't gonna work. So make sure you put the clothing on player owned. And then after that, go ahead and invite um, either a friend or a random to join you. So after they join, you just want to go ahead and start it up. And then when you load in, you just want to go to own outfits and hit right on the D-pad once. And that should give you the, um, the trash man vest. So right here, you guys aren't going to get the um, 
racing gloves only reason why i got the racing gloves is because my other outfit had it and i had switched to it but yeah so if you just want only the trash man vest just go to the owned outfits here right on the d-pad once and then it should put it on whatever outfit that you wanted to have the trash man vest on so after that you could go ahead and um and start up the race i mean the not the race you just want to go ahead and ready up and then you want to tell your friend or the random to also ready up So once the job loads up, all you want to do is just open up your interaction menu, go to your styles, go to accessories, put on either the um, earpiece or the rebreather that I told you guys to buy at Ammunition from earlier. Just go ahead and open up your interaction menu, go to accessories and put on either the rebreather or the earpiece and then after that, you just want to open up your phone and go ahead and quit the job from there. So after you load in, you just want to go ahead and go save um, this outfit and then you get to keep the trash man vest. So if you guys found this video helpful, don't forget to drop a like on it, share it, subscribe and you can keep the um, component, the trash man vest component to try and merge it onto your other outfit. So yeah, that's going to be for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to drop a like on it, share it, subscribe and don't forget to turn your post notifications.